talk about Cyrax first, yeah? I'm very excited. Ooh, Cyrax. I love the Cyber Ninjas. I've loved them since day one in MK3. These are two of my favorite MK characters. So many hand cramps from that combo with Cyrax. Cyrax. The, fun, <laughs> well, the secret is you just hold back and hit high punch and high kick together and it'll come out. That is cheating. Some though. weird old guy at the arcade showed me that. I just always... So painful. So tell me, so when it comes to Cyrax... I'm too young for that reference. <laughs> Gravitate toward the character. Well, here's how set up players for like 30 years for both of them. You have Cyrax is kind of the chickeny trap, sneaky character with the bombs. Even back in '95, you had like the different kind of bombs, the anti-air grab and stuff like that. She kind of forces movement, you know, tries to make the person struggle to get in, and then you hit him with the gnat, and kind of the setup character, kind of a thinking player's character. Right. And then the opposite end of the spectrum, you have Sector, who's like yeah, that's cool. I shoot a homing rocket. Yeah, rockets, rockets, punch. Yeah. Rockets, 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 and all that. Yeah. So, and I think that's something that we <coughs> carried on to this. And but that's not to say. Such well, I don't think she has the punch though. <laughs> stuff, but I think Sarx is going to be a character for really, really creative players, and Sector is going to be a more straightforward character. And I think it's just, it's awesome. They have like the stuff you'd expect from MK9. And then a bunch of new stuff. They both have new mobility options with new technology they didn't have before, and it's very, very cool. I'd say, like a lot of MK1 characters, it's kind of the design team is like, well, what are the key moves that make these characters these characters? Put in some spice. And salt and pepper. And, and some salt and pepper. And, and some ketchup, ketchup and, and mustard. mustard. And then blend it all together, and we have a new take on these classic characters. All right. Do we want to take a look at Cyrex? Let's check her out. Ooh. All right, so one of the new things she has is on her feet, she has these like jet booster things. You can see in a lot of her normal attacks, they uh, allow her to do a wall jump, which is really neat. That's new, I don't think MK has, has ever had that. I mean, it, MK has never had that in the sense of like, they could just do it off the wall on the screen, because obviously you could do like the wall jump from other games, but it usually has to be from an interactable. Like, um, like, you know, like MKX and MK11 and Injustice. Uh, but that's brand new. I think that's, like, new to, like, the series in general. Also has the gadgets you kind of expect. The buzz saws from, like, MK9. Mm -hmm. And speaking of MK9... Hold I on, what would be up on my girl, uh, Katana here? ...is a command grab. She switches places Ooh. or goes into an attack. And you could, like, set a bomb and then it can blow up into them. This was one of her strongest moves in MK9, and this is a true command grab. You know, like, if they're crouch blocking, it will actually... Oh, that was a sick little back throw. She's like the little, like, ballerina pirouette. That was pretty cool. You know, like, if they're crouch blocking... It will uh, actually and then just kicks him in the dome. <laughs> the spin into the kick was, is a wonderful. I absolutely love it. She also has this cool move from Deadly Alliance. Though she looks a little slow. I don't know. Her... Down, charge it up, oh, that's insane. Fun stuff like your grabs. Let it go. Fake it out. Yeah, Cyrex is very slow. I uh, like movement wise. Has these cool step kicks, and this ends in yeah, kind of uh, a ragdoll style uh, move. And when you were saying like tricky, that sort of thing, that spin out into a exactly. throw, like all these sort of you got options. Yeah, yeah. Her standing high kick is another spin spin move, which she can hold it down or cancel it, or she, she can dizzy? do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, that that's part of the robot suit is making right. it so you don't get dizzy. Science. And then this normal attack, which is definitely my favorite, because I think the bomb part is very, very funny. Cool. And the so, bomb part, that, 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 that's normal. It is, yeah. Okay. So let's go into her special moves. First off, you have to have it. It's been one of the most... Her down four is pretty good. ...is your bomb toss. Close, medium, far. A subtle detail I like is the animation actually changes depending on how she's throwing it. Like you can see, mm. the toss is just an overhead toss. Now, something new, the EX version will actually track the opponent and then have a helicopter pop up for even better combos. So if the opponent's <laughs> trying to run away, it'll actually follow them. That's awesome. I will say though, how long does that, what's the duration on that though, on the meter burn? Because Katana can pretty much go full, somewhat full screen with her uh, square wave. So if I was to say they'd set that up in the corner, I just fucking square wave. Is that, is that thing going to chase me to the ends of the fucking earth? <laughs> I'm going to get you. <laughs> then she has a new take on the teleport. 
This time, it's kind of reminiscent of the human Cyrax teleport from MK9, but she leaves a bomb. So she'll teleport behind. Well, to be fair, she's wearing a suit, so she can't really do their normal dismember yourself <laughs> teleport. Or you can do an EX version, but instead of teleporting, Ooh. she kind of... Oh, she has like a fake out. Or forth ...in like kind of a dash kind of thing. If you do it from full screen, she won't go in front of them. But if you're a little bit closer, she will be behind them. More so you tricks. Can kind of mix it up, exactly. And a fun little thing about all of her bomb attacks, if you hold the four button down, the bomb will be a fake out dud. Oh, gotcha! Oh, that's pretty cool. All of her bomb a fun little thing little mind like tricks little mind tricks put out a fake bomb and then actually call a cameo and the opponent's like trying to attack out of it mm -hmm. now another one of these is this spinny spin kick the guile flash kick the X version has armor and a dive kick ender Ooh. and there's an air version that will capture them in the air and if the ex she throws the net oh that's cool and speaking of the net Ooh, one of the okay Plastic net is now this like foam goo to trap them in place, and you get your free combo. But the EX version is similar to the classic net, but with rocket boosters that will push them super far. Oh, that's insane! So you'll see full screen it pushes them far, but you're not going to cut combo. But if you're close to the wall, you still Ends do get the capture state. That's awesome. So it kind of depends on like your space control, where you're at. Mm. I wonder if you do it in the corner, you have enough time to set up a bomb to do a, uh, like, you do a setup into bomb and then you can, like, combo from it. I wonder if that's possible. So that's, you know, just, like we talked about, the upgrading of what was from the past to the future. Uh, I love that throw animation. I can't wait to see the brutality for that. you know, what was famous about her in the past games, and what can we do that's new? But not forgetting the net as well. Exactly. Yeah. But also, not nothing. Oh. <laughs> hey, there we go. Yeah, a lot of great nods to the classic. Mm -hmm. Very cool. So, do you want to finish this out with her x ray? Mm -hmm. See it. Oh, I guess we're, we're seeing her full x ray now. I guess we already saw the full thing, so. Yeah. We've already seen it. I like it. I love that fucking like axe kick to the fucking jaw, dude. It's so sick. I, lo I love it. I think Sector and Cyrax actually have my favorite like fatal blow so far. Because like Sector, not Sector, Cyrax has like she has the axe kick and then Sector has like the multiple punches during the x ray part, which is so cool. Alright, here we go, Sector. high-tech stuff uh, a bunch of gadgets let's go into normals first mm, i don't like their their dash speed one of her cooler normals is her standing two is like this double fist rocket punch but you can charge it up Ooh. and then it gets Ooh. knocked down and you get a lot more damage but the cool thing is she can actually keep the charge by canceling it and oh. now you'll see her fist oh that's pretty cool and she can go straight to the powered up version that's there's cool. also a special move i'll show later they can allow you to charge it. Spoilers. One of her best normals is forward two, one two, which is like this advancing mid that pops up. Everybody loves that one. Oh. It's like oh, so the Jackie Grand, the Grand Slam, <laughs> the Jackie Ground Slam. You don't need a meter burn that for the pop up. Oh, okay. One of her best normals is forward two, one two, which is like this advancing mid that pops up. Mm -mm -mm. Oh. Dude, that's so sick. Okay. Combo starter. She also has this big swinging overhead with her rocket launcher. Oh, I want to see this. Is can you yeah. cancel this? Compliment it nope. Below I guess not. Rocket boots. She has a really cool forward three four. Goes into the okay, that's forward three four. The 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 flying knee into the spin kick is her forward three four. Okay. Spent a lot of time in the air. Yeah, and you can see, like, oh, I love the Muay Thai, like, little fucking... Look at that. I love that. Uh, uh. Yeah, like, little Muay Thai knee was so sick. I love that. Some of my favorite, like, that, the finish of that move, I love 
I love crumples like that. Yes. One of my favorite reactions. Okay. To I'm gonna I'm gonna somewhat predict her uh, her back throw brutality. So watch this. Watch this. So my favorite. So the grab. I think the grab is kind of probably like either it flips them over, she rips her head off, and then she sets them on fire. Or I don't know. Don't listen to me. I think that that would be pretty cool. Or that shit, like I don't know. They that changed the way some of these throw brutalities work, but uh, I could see that. Like she grabs them, she like that, or she like fucking just bisects them with the with the with the grappling. What the fuck am I trying to say? The um, yeah, the little the little mechanical hand there. <laughs> uh. Like that. Mm. Yes. One of my favorite reactions. For sweep, and uppercut. I love this new take on the MK3 throw. Ooh, mm -hmm. One of the coolest throws in the game. Let's go over her special moves. First, we can start like Cyrax. She has a new mobility tool, which is these rocket boosters, which allow her to do an air dash. That's cool. She can do normal attacks from it. She can do some of her moves. She can double it. A really cool way to get around. So you'll see Bro, I'm gonna be doing some fucking melty blood mix-ups with the with the fucking what's it called? In the air, the opponent's gonna have a hard time because of her zoning tools. She can shoot her rocket. If you That's a high. It actually catches them on fire and does a little. Is that a restand? That was amazing. She has a jumping rocket. If you ex this one, she can actually decide when the rocket will go off. Like you can do it early, or you can hold it halfway through, let it go when it hits the ground, etc. And then she has this awesome one, probably my favorite move, the Sidewinder. And if you EX it, you get the absolute classic MK3. Targeting. Targeting rocket. I love when fans used to call it dumb rocket and smart rocket. <laughs> <laughs> I love the targeting uh, application. I'm pretty sure people still call them the smart missiles. <laughs> awesome. yeah. And then one more rocket move, her anti-air rockets. Which are also oh, so they're more of an anti-air. Oh, okay, okay. So they're not like the traditional air rockets like you saw in uh, MK9 and MKX where you call them out, they fly up, and then you can like like uh, target wherever they land. This one's specifically like anti-air. Okay, okay. That's pretty cool. So I wonder if you anti-air with it, can you combo from it? That'd be nice. Then let's go into a flamethrower. Wouldn't be sexual without a flamethrower. Okay, so I was right about that on the uh, at, uh, on, on her trailer that it's a knockdown. I think I said that at least. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> but yeah, the meter burns a restand, but the normal version just knocks them down. This double hit, really good range. EX version, she can hold it down, cancel the second hit, and this has armor. Oh. She also has Blast Shield, where she clamps her feet on the ground. What the hell? Yo, she stole that from Robocop. What the fuck? This absorbs projectiles and has some. Bro, she stole that from Robocop. What the hell? Really fun follow ups. So, the regular version, when she absorbs a projectile, she can quickly input one of her rocket moves. Insane. So it's almost like she's sending something right back. Exactly. Now, the EX version. They're right back at you. actually do any of her special moves. I did not mean to do her x ray. <laughs> no. You can do her oh. teleport Ooh. in a second. And one other cool thing about this move is absorbing a projectile successfully gives you a charge of her standing, too. Oh, that's pretty cool. That is a lot. And then she also has the teleport, which I just said we talked about. She goes up, then she's. Not really a teleport, but yeah. It's kind of a new take on the classic uppercut, mm. and if you EX it, it's even more similar. It actually starts off with the punch. Right. She is all over the screen. Dude. Yeah, so Dude, I can't wait to play Sector, man. Can't wait to get my hands on her. Absolutely. Dominate the Pause. Air. She can be in the air, but she's going to stop you from being in the air. So you're going to have to play the ground game. And then she has awesome range. Bro, they just gave me back Robocop, essentially. <laughs> just some interesting tricks, too, with the like, all, all Sector needs is a command grab, and I got my boy Robocop, uh, Robocop back. <laughs> you know, because Robocop had the, uh, had the rocket, had the, had the, the low gun shot, had the big-ass fucking sniper, had the bombs, had the flamethrower, had the electrical mine. Like, dog, it's... It, Come on, man. 
Just give Sector a command grab. I'll be I'll be happy. <laughs> really needs to, your, your opponent's gonna have to decide if you, they see you use meter on that. What are you doing? Which makes me wonder. Now that I, now I'm thinking about it with her shield. How does that work against Reiko since Reiko's projectiles are multi-hitting? Because I'm assuming it absorbs, like, say, the first hit and then she gets hit by the rest. I'll we'll have to test that out when she comes out, right? We'll test it out. We'll test it out. Dude, that fucking Muay Thai uh, knee and elbow combo. I love it so much. I fucking love that. Targeted. No way. She did the fucking uh, uh, she did the brainiac fucking like laser point down. That's pretty cool. Grab him by the face. I love this fucking fatal dude. Uh, uh I love that. It's so good. So good. I love it. I love it. All right. So Cyrax and Sector. There they are. Hell yeah, dude. I'm so hyped for Sector, man. Pretty stoked for this. Didn't and know that. I can't wait for people to see Chaos Reigns, their role in this story. Mm -hmm. um, it's very, very different. It is the new era, but there are some aspects that sometimes time refuses to change. Like, Sector is very much all in on the Liu Kang, or the, the Lin Kuei, and the cybernetic process. And maybe Cyrex has some reservations. No spoilers. Stuff. You'll have to see. And then, and of course, new Cybot is, is going to be awesome. So we will be uh, having another stream. Boom to bias. No date yet. We'll be talking about Noob Cybot and some other stuff. Yep, yep, yep. And yep. definitely some other character things that are coming. And in uh, general, like, just Chaos Reign up yeah, updates, right? For sure, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Uh, so we'll let you know when we know when that's going to be. Uh, but until then, I think that's it for us today. If you haven't pre-ordered yet, be sure you pre-order so you can get the exclusive skins. Some Absolutely. Really cool skins. Absolutely. Uh, we do, though, after we sign off, as usual... There will be a sector fight against Tanya that uh, QA put together. Oh, Tanya. So with that, Tanya. Thank you both okay. For oh, always you. being here, it's oh, always a great time. Always Damn. So we're not gonna get a Cyrax fight. We're gonna get a Tanya fight. Wait, what? <laughs> we're gonna. Uh, we're not gonna get a Cyrax fight. We're not gonna get a Cyrax fight. We're just gonna get the. I'm sorry, guys. I've literally just got off work, so I'm. A, I'm a little. I'm. A, I'm a little tired currently. <laughs> uh, so we're not getting a Cyrax fight. We're getting a Sector fight instead. Well, I guess it makes sense considering uh, we literally just had Sector's trailer yesterday at the time of recording yesterday. Thank you all for joining us, and we will see you next. So here we go. We're gonna see uh, some Cyrax gameplay. Cyrax, God damn it. Uh, Sector gameplay. The maze. You've created more mechanized monstrosities. Many. And I can't wait to unleash them. Round one, fight. All this music's insane. Oh, that was a sexy combo with Frost. I like it. That was a sexy little combo with Frost. Okay, that was a sick interaction. What an insane setup. What the fuck? Oh, so she could do that back three off of that. Okay. <laughs> I can't wait to use that. Four twenty two, goddamn. Round 
Oh, okay. They just showed it. You can cancel the overhead. You can cancel the overhead. Watch this. Uh, 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 okay. So you can't cancel the overhead. That's pretty cool. I, I kind of called that. That was a sick fucking, what's it called? Oh, this taunting is going insane, dude. Dude, dude, that fucking ice parry has insane startup, man. It has insane startup. That was definitely punishable. Oh, clip the feet. Damn, so you could basically go into anything from the shield. Did you see that? They did shield into frost. Holy shit. That's pretty sick. Alright, Tanya, you're, <laughs> you're what's it called in the script here? You're supposed to lose this. <laughs> I saw the vision, but you fucked up. Ooh. Uh, damn. Oh, no. They gave her that brutality again. Bro, Robocop had that. I think, I think, I think, uh, no. I think Triborg had that brutality in MKX where they did like the shoulder charge. He got a brutality, but fucking Robocop had that in MK11. I, ne I, to be fair, I never used that move, but I don't think I've ever gotten that fucking brutality before. But that was sick. Damn, I just realized that the double, she destroys the body, comes back, and then destroys the head. That's pretty insane. Ooh, hold on. Was that was the Muay Thai knee a restand? It is okay. Oh yeah, it was the head. The short the body than the head. God damn, bro. She looks insane, dude. Oh my god. The more I see more... The more I see of Sector, the more height I get, man. I can't wait to get my hands on her the 24th, bro. She just looks so insane. And I, I kind of learned a little bit from uh, from that from that fight there. Like, that Muay Thai knee that she does, it's actually a restand. Or at least they, uh... I think it puts them in a crumple state. I don't think it's a true restand. It's a crumple state. And then it went into frost, and then did the uh, did the combo. That that was pretty sick. That was pretty sick. That was pretty sick, man. I I can't wait. Kind of bummed. I actually want to see some Cyrax now too. I want to see I want to see some uh, some developer Cyrax gameplay. You know, kind of. You're right. In, I mean, to be fair, I kind of only really care for Sector at the moment. But I would love to see what they would have done with uh, with Cyrax in that fight. Uh, but. Oof, that was sick, bro. That that ice parry from Sub Zero cameo is insanely fast. It's insanely fast, man. So uh, definitely be abusing that fucking move until they nerf it, <laughs> you know. But man, Sector just looks insane. I I legit cannot wait to play her when she drops, man. Again, it sucks. That I'm I'm working that day, so again, who knows? I might call off. Hey, <laughs> you know. But uh, that's going to be it for today's video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. And if you did, like, comment, and subscribe. It is your boy, White Album. I will see you guys next time.